I have a project here that I was uh, doing last night and I didn't even think to make a video of it but tonight I decided I'd like to show you my little Altoids uh, little can candles I don't know get up there all it is is a couple of wicks and some old candles that I had laying around those were uh, emergency candles for that one now this pink one, unfortunately it's pink, was made out of just regular candles like this one is. So, uh, first off, a little bit of safety. I am using a, a propane thing right here. So, be very careful with these. And of course, I, I pick everything up with one of these. So I don't burn myself. Uh, you can wear safety glasses if you want to, and gloves. Anyway, what you're going to need is one of these propane uh, flame thingies. So I don't know what it's called. Anyway, you need one of those. You need an empty Altoids can, and I just got a couple of wicks from an old candle. I just pulled it out the bottom, and I super glued them to the bottom of the Altoids can. And you need something to melt your wax in. And perhaps, you know, vice grips or whatever, you know, to hold it. And of course, I always use this to uh, light the propane. Since I have it, I could use a lighter, but I have that, so I use it. And let's light this puppy. See if this works the first time. There we go. Put that inside. You really don't need that much gas coming out. The wax will start boiling and that's when you start getting into the danger zone. And so I'll come over here, grab this. And this is pretty much all you do, just to melt your wax. Get on camera. And so we're not sitting here watching me uh, melt candle wax. I am going to put this down and stop the camera and fast forward to when it's done. Okay, we're back. The uh, wax is melted now. So all you have to do at this point, hopefully this is in frame, yeah. All you have to do is carefully pour it into your Altoids can. And hopefully I... Milk is enough wax. Yes, I did. Very good. Set this to the side. So that would be tragic to start a fire by making a candle. You know, I'm doing this out here in the shop because my wife uh, obviously wouldn't want me to be doing this inside the house. It smell like a or melted wax. There we go. Position the wicks a little bit better. And that's pretty much it for this project. I use these in the field sometimes. But anyway, it's a pretty cool little project. Make something out of uh, your, your old candles. Instead of throwing them away, remelt them, get some wicks, put them in an Altoids can. And once you light them, it's got two, two wicks there, so once you light them, puts out a good deal of uh, light there and all you have to do when you want to put them out just close the Altoids can they go immediately out set it to the side let it solidify and there you go an Altoids candle in the can I know this is probably not very original but you know how hard it is to come up with something original but I thought this was uh, noteworthy anyway that's my uh little candle making project with the Altoids can. thought you might enjoy this. That's pretty much it. I gotta let it solidify and it's ready to go. I can put it in my bag or I can put it in the house somewhere where everybody knows where it is so if the lights do go out and our flashlights aren't available. So anyway, peace!